I'm finally moving out of this of this place like it's been long awaited I've been wanting to move out for the past five months and I'm glad the day is finally come because wow <laughs> This is like a uni move-in vlog because I didn't give you one when I moved here because this place is just I moved here because I had no no other option so I'll tell you the reasons why I'm moving and stuff when I'm all settled in my new place and stuff so yeah I'm just so happy like like I'll tell you everything guys like excuse me I've been through a lot in this place like but anyways yeah let me leave because the rest of is waiting for me she's been wanting to kick me out but anyways it's fine i'll talk to you guys probably on monday because that's when the whole moving is happening um so yeah <laughs> So I am in my room now. I'm so happy. Like you guys don't understand how happy I am right now. So I just have to move my stuff because I placed uh, my stuff in the study room because there's still someone in my room. So I just have to go take those stuff and unpack and everything. Like I'll show you my room. Like it's. It's nice, it's, it's, it's cute, it's, it's, it's cute, it's little, like, it's private, like, I'm so happy, and there's someone busy checking everything in the background, like, yo, I bo, what I shot, everything is perfect, <laughs> but anyways, yeah, oh, and then after I'm done, like, unpacking and stuff, I'll then tell you guys why, I moved from my old race. Mm -hmm. Yeah, even the views, like it's not that much, but it's nice. You feel me? Um, I would have wished for a room that side because there's a better view that side. But that's fine still. It's not that bad. Okay, then I'm gonna show you a before and after. So right now I'm just gonna film like the before before I unpack and everything. And then I'm gonna show you after. Yeah, my hand is tired. Oh, okay, yeah basically this is how it looks um outside like like not outside inside get in you know there's like this little kitchenette or whatever pretty i know i mean um cupboard space a little induction stove here you know a microwave a fridge and then a huge study desk love this for myself thank you so much because when I study, like, I'm missing my books are everywhere and I need, like, a huge study space. And I have many books, so that is going to come in handy. Yeah, and then here's my here's my view. Um, It's not that pretty, but I like it. It's not bad. As I said, I wished I had a room that side. You see that side? Yeah. And then here's my bed. You know, the heater. And then cupboard space, let's see. How do you open the ship? Yeah, it's not bad. Oh, I can also hang my jacket. Yeah, because I I have many clothes, but they're not that many. Okay, my shoes then. Okay, perfect. And then my favorite. This is my favorite. I have my own bathroom, like shower. Like I am not sharing anything. <laughs> Guys, like I'm so happy. But in days, yeah, let me unpack and then I'll talk to you guys later. <laughs>
I am so tired, I'm so hungry. Um, yeah, so I'm just gonna show you guys. And please don't judge because I just moved in, so there's not much to it. I still have to buy a lot of stuff, um, like groceries and you know, all the type of ish. So, yeah, let me show you. Obviously, from the door, there's the kitchen and stuff. So, I put my thingies there and my wooden spoon. Spoons. I just popped this in because there's no place to put it basically. Yeah, the stove and then the fridge, which is really empty. Please um, send the girl money. Um, my fridge is really empty, like it's depressing. And then from the fridge, there's my cupboard space, yeah. obviously, my thingy, my bathroom. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then me, per. Um, and then my. Yeah, and then my bed which i want to change my bedding because i think it's like too pink now so i want to change it to like white and stuff i don't know why it looks like that like it's not iron because i did iron it but anyways yeah not the prettiest setup because i'm tired and i'm just gonna come and sleep right after but guys i actually forgot to show you this like i like it it's cute and simple to make to my bed um i need help with something though so you'll see my room right like all the spaces i want to fill them up you know basically i need your help so i have like a vision board that i printed out so i need help on where um to put it because like i really don't know because i'm gonna go print it out on monday um and stuff so please comment down below where i should put it like all over yeah, because my room is so plain and I don't want it too plain. So, yeah. Oh, and then my box and then my trophy. Yeah, I think there is like good lighting. So, let me tell you guys like why I moved out of that place. Okay, so my hand is going to get tired, but that's fine. Okay, the reason why I moved, firstly, like I initially didn't want to stay there. Like from the first place, I didn't want to stay there. It was my last option. All the races were all the races that I wanted were for, and the one that I really, really wanted didn't um take my bursary. So yeah, so then I had to go to that place because the other races that were that had space, um, pardon, were like far, and I didn't want to stay far as yet because I wasn't used to like the environment and all that before me so then um yeah i moved i i went to stay there in brixton first years if you're gonna go in to uj please do not stay in brixton because wow i won't uh, mention the name of the race because yeah i don't want to do that 
but anyways yeah so firstly i initially didn't want to stay there secondly when i got there you know, like the first two weeks were fine the water from the shower was good like the water in the shower was good like it was hot and then after that like it went cold um so we couldn't shower in like our flat we had to so the rest is like separated into two there's one on this side and one on one across the road so for for me for like the people that lived in our flat to shower we had to cross the road and shower at the other rest every day now imagine it's 7 a.m it's cold in the morning and you have to cross the street to go shower make that make sense but anyways yeah the other reason was that like okay so when i moved there i didn't have a roommate right but then i i because i didn't want a roommate like jay i didn't want one but then i got one in like april or something and ugh, sometimes sharing is not fine like sharing is not nice okay and then that was the second thing third thing actually second or third i can't remember okay and then the other reason i moved was because um like the management was bad like literally it was bad the rest when it hadn't when she wants her rent she will call you she will text you she will send people to your room but when you need help from her child she is mia okay like literally she's mia my hand is so tired so i feel like a constant movement okay like she will be mia if you need help another thing is so i had i did my washing this other day did my laundry and then so as i said like there are two races it's this, under the same like management but like there are different races so i didn't hang my clothes in my race because the thingy what is it called the washing line they don't get locked like the place where you hang your clothes they don't get locked but at the other race you lock it and you have to sign in every day so i went to hang my washing day did they not steal my stuff they stole my stuff i found and some of my clothes on the floor and then i reported that to like the student com they said they would help but student com didn't tell the race manager i don't know if she's the race manager race mother or whatever and then when i went to report to her instead of helping me find my things she tells me that why did i hang my clothes where i don't stay why did i hang my clothes at the other race and not this one i'm like bro this one is more safer because like you lock the thing in and at my race you don't lock so i thought like it was much safer but i guess i was wrong another reason why i moved um was as i said the management was bad the the water was bad like everything was bad even the race itself is all gray okay the my race like the other side was not that bad but the other side <laughs> so yeah if i forgot something i'm, go I'm just gonna put it like on the screen another thing i forgot to mention is that the race is not safe at all so when we got there there were no biometrics no entering with fingerprints and everything so a few weeks back or like a month back someone got into the race and stole um laptops and phones of these other girls that are not in the room at that time so they only then implemented the biometrics and everything after that incident happened and still those biometrics are not effective because anyone can still enter if like a, there's a friend if that person has a friend in race they can enter like easy like that because even the securities they don't even check they don't you know it's just bad like everything is bad so yeah but those are the reasons why i moved like i couldn't stay there any much longer like everything was really really bad like i just couldn't i just couldn't but anyways yeah now i've moved now i'm happy like i'm happy i'm not showing you know everything like is good like i'm genuinely happy i can start like because when i am um, the start of second semester i am moving right but then i couldn't move i had to go back to that place and i couldn't even focus on school because that place is so toxic but now I can focus on school. Right now I'm just gonna um, take a shower, eat, and stop with my school because you know productive goes worldwide. But anyways, yeah, guys, um, we've reached the end of this video. Please do like, comment, and subscribe to my channel because it's only lit content from here on. Trust me, that content is it's gonna be immaculate. Like my hands are like this because. 
I was cleaning. But yeah, from here on, the content is lit. So yeah, please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, guys.